Your future, Yarikawa. They're leaving. Let's go. If Yarikawa surrenders, Lord Shimura won't get his army. Don't worry. They're too stubborn to surrender. If they don't, it will be a bloodbath. They need my uncle as much as he needs them. United, we can beat back the invaders. People here have bad memories of Lord Shimura. If they're going to survive, Yarikawa needs to let go of the past. Easier said than done. Ujimasa knows you're here. You two go ahead. I want to check on the swordsmith. Lord Sakai. Ujimasa Yarikawa. I never thought Lord Shimura's nephew would be responsible for the ghost. You best be careful, or he'll punish you. As he punished my once great family for inciting rebellion against your Jito. That was years ago. We've all got bigger problems now. Who's this? Your servant? I was born here. Yet you're aiding Clan Shimura. No, I'm fighting for Lord Sakai. For the ghost. We can help break the siege outside your walls. In return, Lord Shimura requests your help. <laughs> the Mongols want to conquer the mainland. They will lose interest in us. And Yarikawa will survive. Like we always do. That could have gone better. Let's find Taka. Ujimasa is a fool. We can be convinced. The whole island's burning, and Yarikawa is next. If that doesn't convince him, nothing will. Taka used to visit this swordsmith every day. If there was any leftover metal, he'd let my brother pretend to make swords. The swordsmith remembered you? Shinsuke passed away. That's his son. How did it go? Ujimasa thinks they can outlast the siege. The smith told me all the best archers left to fight the Mongols, against Ujimasa's orders. They've been missing for days. If we find these archers, they may help us break the Mongol siege. And win the town's support. Meet me in old Yarikawa when you can. We'll look for them there. And show Yarikawa how to fight back. Shinsuke's son still has the rock. The one you used to hammer out your swords? 